Josh. Hmm. What's bothering you? Uh, I found out last night that uh, Reva's with Richard in San Cristobal. What? Are you sure? Yeah, yeah. I heard Philip talking on the phone to Harley. She's down there too. And so. and she said that Reva's. Reva's there. Yeah. <sighs> You think that she went back to Richard? Well, I don't think she's down there for the weather. No, look, just, just because she's in San Cristobal doesn't mean that she's there for Richard. She could be there to see Kathy. No, she's there with him. In fact, they're, uh, they're going off someplace together. Uh, like, a, like a romantic... Yeah, you know what? Um, I'm sorry, I shouldn't have even <sighs> mentioned it. That's not what we're here for, to talk about stuff like that. We're here to working to eat, so. I'm sorry. No, don't be. It's, uh, it's no big deal. I'm, I'm done with that. I, I don't care about what Reba does. Yes, you do care about what she does. You wouldn't be human if you didn't. You're right. And, uh, it more than just bothers me. It, uh, it hurts. I thought I wanted Reva to sort through her feelings, you know, for her sake. Whether they included Richard or not. But, but you didn't? Well, I don't know anymore. I don't think I realized uh, what, a, what a big factor he still is and whatever it is she's going through. I, I guess she never really got over him. I'm sorry. I, I, I no, didn't realize no, how strongly no, no. you felt about... You have nothing to say I'm sorry about, okay? I, yeah, the weird thing is, I, I, I've been trying to, you know, protect her. I've been trying to spare her feelings. You mean about me? Yeah, mm. yeah. I, I figured if she knew about us, it would, you know, it would hurt her. I guess I was wrong, though. Josh, you weren't wrong. It, it would have hurt her. Well, I don't, I don't know. I know the breakup hurt her. I know, I know that left her pretty raw. That's why I wanted to slow things down. Josh. <laughs> You did the right thing, okay? You were just being sensitive to everyone. And that's why I wanted to keep this sort of simple. But already she's off with Richard. So maybe it, it really was about him. You know what? I'm sorry, but we <laughs> we shouldn't be talking about this. I shouldn't be going off about Reba like this with no, you. I, no, I, 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 I really told you, I want you to be able to talk to me about anything. And that includes Reba doesn't bother you at all. It would bother me more if you didn't talk about it. You and Reva have a long, rich history, and that's not going to go away overnight. These things, they, they take time, you know, to get past. Well, Reva got over it pretty quick. Maybe there's still hope for me. You can joke about it all you want. I know this is hurting you. What about you? Me? Yeah, you. <laughs> it's got to be difficult for you, too, I mean, considering your history with Richard. Um, actually, it isn't. Not at all. When Reva came back to San Cristobal and I watched Richard turn to her again, that was devastating. And I um, made a mistake and spent a lot of time wallowing. But you saw that. <sighs> wallowing is such an ugly word. Well, okay, Just dragging doesn't... my feet, whatever. <laughs> it, the point is, is that I, I got some distance from it, and after a while I got to see what a horrible mess the whole thing was and how lucky I was to be out of it. You told me that once. I did? Yeah, you told me that I deserved better. Yes, I did. So I made a decision to move on with my life and live it. And I'm glad that I did, because right now I'm sitting here with you. A person I truly care about. It's just gonna take some time, Josh, but the pain will go away. I promise.
Yeah. You know, everybody deals with things differently. That's just how I, I dealt with my stuff. I understand that. But I see that I have to move on with my life. That I can't spend all my time trying to figure out what Reva's doing or where she is. I can never figure her out anyway, you know. You're gonna be okay? Yeah. I'm worried about my kids. Well, you know, why don't you get out of here? Go do something fun with them. That'll make you feel better. I can do this. Uh, yeah, yeah. They're, they're not here. They're, they're on a ski trip right now. Oh. Well, then why don't you let me do something for you? Let's get out of here. You can go where? I'll make you dinner. And we'll open a bottle of wine. And maybe pop in a Marx Brothers movie. You own a Marx Brothers movie? You should get a load of my video collection. And we will just, we'll just forget about everybody else for the night, okay? We'll have a really nice time. That sounds great. And thank you for helping me to feel better. You are quite a lady. Right now, they've come to take him. I know they have. What is it? What's wrong? Riva and Richard are not in San Cristobal. They're at my sister's. They found Jonathan. Richard and Riva. What do they want, Marissa? They've come to take John away. Why else would they be here? Well, maybe they just want to check on him, you know? Make sure he's doing well. What should I do? Just be nice to them. You show them how much Jonathan belongs there with you, okay? You stay calm. Don't worry, honey. It's gonna be all right. I'll take care of it. I love you, too. Reva is gonna try and take Jonathan away from no. her. I know it. No, no, no. I can understand Richard trying to do something like that, but not Reva. It doesn't make any sense. Well, apparently she's changed her mind, Josh. No. No, you need to open your eyes about this, okay? <sighs> this is not about Jonathan anymore. This is about Reva wanting Richard back. And she's using John to get to him. God, why, is... why would she use Jonathan? What better way to get Richard back? No, I'm sorry. It tore Reva apart to leave Jonathan with your sister. But she did it anyway. She wouldn't uproot him now. But if she loves Richard that much, how did she find out where he was? Huh? What did she do? She'd sneak into my room and go through my papers? When? The other day. Well, we were on our date. You said you saw her. Oh, boy. Oh, Wait a minute. No, no, no. Now, come on now. Where are you going? I want to get just, on a plane and go see no, my sister. No. You don't want to do that, okay? If Reva's down there, I, I'm sure she has some kind of reason. There, there must be some... Josh, she is not going to quit until she gets what she wants. But you know if that. If you go down there and start going after Reva, you're just going to make things worse. What am I supposed to do? Just sit back and do nothing? I am not going to let her destroy my sister's life just so she can get what she wants, Okay. Come here often? You want to talk about this? Not unless something we say will change something. My sister will be devastated if Eva takes Jonathan away from her. I don't get this. You know, Reva knew what this would do to everybody, and she's going to go ahead and do it anyway. We don't know how it's going to turn out yet. Josh, just the fact that they are down there, they are not going to leave without their son. Don't you see? She did it. She got what she wanted. She got her, the husband that she loves and the family. And... Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. I knew something like this was going to happen no, sooner or later. No, I'm so. sorry. All I was thinking about was my own family. I was really, thinking how much it was hurting you. Don't, don't say you're sorry for anything, okay? It's... I've known Reva for a long time, and... Uh...
I didn't really believe that she was going to go back to Richard. I took an army down there to rescue her, to take her away from there, and, and all along, what she really wanted was to stay, and I guess I just, I just didn't see that. Well, maybe you did, you know, maybe that's why you're sitting here now with me. Reefa got what she wanted. Maybe I did too. But it does seem that Reefa and I are fine.